Hey everyone, welcome back to the show. In today's video we're diving into one of the most revolutionary concepts of the 21st century, Bitcoin and decentralized money systems. If you've ever wondered how Bitcoin works, why it's such a big deal, or who the mysterious creator behind it is, you're in the right place. Let's start with the basics. Bitcoin is a type of digital currency but not like the money we're used to, it's decentralized, meaning it doesn't rely on any central authority like a government or bank to issue, control or verify transactions. Instead, Bitcoin runs on a technology called blockchain. A blockchain is a decentralized digital ledger that records all Bitcoin transactions across a network of computers. Every time you send or receive Bitcoin, the transaction is added to a block, and once that block is filled, it's connected to the previous block, forming a chain. This makes it nearly impossible to alter past transactions, adding a layer of security. Why is decentralization so important? Well, traditionally money is controlled by banks and governments, which can affect the value of money through things like inflation or monetary policy. But with Bitcoin, no one controls it. There's no middleman, and it's borderless, meaning anyone in the world can access and use Bitcoin. Bitcoin's decentralized nature also means that it's resistant to censorship. Without asking permission from a bank or government, which is especially useful in places where traditional financial systems are unstable. So how does holding Bitcoin benefit you? Well, there are a few key points. Limited supply. Unlike traditional money, Bitcoin has a limited supply. There will only ever be 21 million Bitcoins. This scarcity makes it similar to precious metals like gold, which can protect against inflation. Store of value. Many people see Bitcoin as a store of value. In times of economic uncertainty, Bitcoin can act as a hedge against inflation or currency devaluation. It's like having digital gold, security and ownership. With Bitcoin, you're your own bank. No one can seize your funds or freeze your account. As long as you keep your private keys safe, you have full control over your assets. Potential for growth. Bitcoin has also seen significant price appreciation since its launch, leading many to view it as an investment opportunity with potential for growth. Now let's talk about the mystery behind Bitcoin's creation. Bitcoin was introduced in 2008 by an anonymous person or group using the name Satoshi Nakamoto. To this day, no one knows who Satoshi really is. Some think Satoshi could be a single person, while others believe it might be a group of individuals. What's for sure is that Satoshi Nakamoto laid the groundwork for Bitcoin's peer-to-peer -peer network and blockchain technology, changing the way we think about money forever. Satoshi Nakamoto published a white paper in 2008 titled, Bitcoin a Peer-to-Peer -peer Electronic Cash System. This document outlined the vision for a decentralized currency and provided the blueprint for creating Bitcoin. Since its creation, Bitcoin has grown from an idea into a global phenomenon. It has inspired the creation of thousands of cryptocurrencies and has sparked conversations about how financial systems could be reimagined in a more open and transparent way. Today, Bitcoin isn't just a digital asset, it's a movement. It's empowering individuals to take control of their finances and offering an alternative to traditional banking systems. So, whether you see Bitcoin as a revolutionary financial tool, a long-term investment, or just an interesting technology, one thing is clear. It's changing the way we think about money. And the mystery of Satoshi Nakamoto continues to intrigue us all. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update. Have any questions about Bitcoin or cryptocurrency? Drop them in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you think. Thanks for tuning into the show. Stay curious and I'll see you in the next video.